All right, here we go. ISSO and Security Control Assessor Duties in a Nutshell. So who is an ISSO? ISSO stands for Information System Security Officer. Uh, SCA stands for Security Control Assessor. Um, so in the RMF, in, in, in the line of assessment and authorization, the whole point, uh, the whole goal line is to get a system authorized, to get a system, the green light, to install the, the, the system on the production network. All right, so step one, you have the users. These guys are trying to get their system authorized, users over here. So what they do is they go to the ISSO um, and tell him, hey, he, him or her, hey, I need to get my system authorized. The ISSO walks them through the authorization process. So he tells them, hey, um, I'm going to categorize your information system and then apply security controls. You guys need to apply the security controls. I'm giving you um, the guidance on what security controls to apply. So what are security controls? Security controls are... Um, things that you put in place to reduce risk. So policies like um, acceptable use um, policies on the internet. Don't download games. Don't click on suspicious links. That will be a policy, a security control. Uh, firewall will be a security control. So uh, once the ISSO uh, apply, uh, gives the users not, or, or the project team, project team could be the administrator or a developer, whoever's going to do the installation, um, they go ahead and implement that stuff. They implement the security controls based off the guidance that the ISSO has given. So then the security control assessor audits, like he, he assesses the security controls to see if they're um, operating according to uh, compliance guidelines then he or she passes or fails those security controls and gives them a list of the, the findings. So the outcome of the assessment, which is the SAR, System Assessment Report. Um, the security control assessor gives that to the ISSO and the um, project team, um, then tells them, hey, this is what failed, this is what passed. Uh, these are recommendations on how to remediate, how to fix those stuff. Um, if they are not able to fix the findings in time, then something called a POEM is created. A POEM just means um, plan of actions and milestones. So the POEMs will be a list of those findings that were not able to be, uh, that were not fixed. And... Um, the cost associated with trying to fix the, those um, findings on uh, the timeline on when the, the findings will be fixed and um, that type of information. Once uh, the project team gets the POAM, the SAR, the SSP, which is uh, the um, system security um, plan, he, he, um, they, the ISSO then goes to this guy over here called the AO, the authorizing official, briefs the authorizing official uh, on the risk posture of that system. And then the authorizing official takes all the information in the security package and makes a risk-based decision and says, hey, hey, based off what you've told me, I think this system can be authorized. Or based on what you told me, I think the system um, needs to be denied. And then um, once he approves the system, he gives them what's called an ATO, an authority to operate. So that's um, that's the job in a nutshell. Um, so you, you see here, there's no technical stuff. There's no coding. There's no um, trying to fix stuff or Im uh, implement stuff. It's pure policy-based uh, and procedure-based. So this is something anyone could do, anyone who has a passion for cybersecurity, you could actually do this job. So give us a call.
If you want to become a security control assessor on ISSO, let's go to www.cyberfirstsolutions.com or you could go to our um, other site for questions and answers and um, some other uh, vi training videos, www.cyberfirstacademy.com. But to register for the classes, go to www.cyberfirstsolutions.com. Thank you.